Starting off with Zig Kuwaiti Dinar community member story I was working in Rada in 1989 for a developer in Ahmed my boss was telling me of a rumor that Kuwait was planning to adjust their currency and remember Iraq was attacking Kuwait's oil wells well with the help of USA and international assistance adjustments were about to take place he never heard the RV by the name just an adjustment their currency at that time was 0.05 and while I bought quite a bit of their currency quite a bit in Rada I was back in Honolulu around March when my currency broker from the past called me at home I mentioned that Kuwait's currency adjusted to a higher value 3.47 USD I called my bank bank of Hawaii and they confirmed so I went with my bills and cashed them and I had to show my passport with the date when I was in Egypt it was my former boss and saw that called after their re slash adjustment then I went through his broker it went from 5 cents to 3.47 USD it was just an exchange no tax there is more to the story it did happen and no of course to consult your tax professionals at the appropriate time to determine the proper tax for your unique circumstances all right Sandy Ingram article quote Iraqi and peace loyal to Mustaka al Sadr resign okay people this is no longer just talk um Iraqi lawmakers loyal to the popular al father resigned from parliament in order to break the country's political deadlock the question now is who will fill these seats what does the constitution say about empty parliament cease will parliament elect a new government by this time next week all right and caperoni says as long as maliki has power there's a chance that nothing's going to happen in iraq and it seems to be more and more coming true he has now pushed al Sadr out of the political process not good samson article quote al how busy accepts the resignations of this us cyrus blocks deputies the speaker of iraqi parliament mohammed al halbuzi approved on sunday the resignation of the sadris blocks deputies shortly after a directive issued by al Sadr to his deputies in this regard um question i want to hear from why 70 percent of the legislators in iraq all at once up and resigned mark z says it was their intention to force the government to be sat this is not a negative it's a gigantic positive they're forcing a conclusion to all the gridlock they're moving quickly to a culmination of events with the block of parliament resigning no longer have gridlock and have already paid iran for their electricity i think we'll see a lot of news out of iraq in the next few days now that they're off stuck right militiamen article quote al habuzi accepts the resignations of sadis block deputies the resignation of the largest block puts kazimi and sala in office for an additional two years they'll from the looks of it dissolve parliament that takes away the immunity for those that have committed corruption against the state sets up the stage for early elections and finishing up two years of power for Kazimi at the helm as Prime Minister I. Imagine this next week is going to be eventful Frank 26 where we used to be miles away in my opinion we are now inches away not so much from an announcement of a new exchange rate but of an announcement from these new ATM machines all right Tivan article quote the crisis of the value of Iraqi dinar against dollar are we facing a breakthrough Tivan says why would this particular guy figure now is the time to seize the opportunity to correct exchange rate of the Iraqi dinar maybe because the hard currency reserves is approaching full coverage of the dinar maybe because Baghdad now has the oil contracts and food security law maybe because they also have customs and border under full control which adds to their revenues because now that food security law basically covers the local market where the governance can subsidize products and sell them cheaper to the citizens materials will not be affected if the change the exchange rate because what did Mazar Salas state that hard currency reserves will protect Iraq against any future inflation all right and Mark Z via PDK I'm still being leaned on to not share specifics of who is where for security there are certain timing things I'm still being asked not to share this any of 
This decider timing I don't think so but I will keep playing their game because we are seeing. Progress news from Iraq is up and down a lot of conflicting articles about solder the blocks etc. Let it play out it should all come together in the next 24 to 48 hours all right Samson article. Quote new details about the upcoming framework meeting al Sadr's negotiating committee to reverse. The resignations quote the meeting that will be held by the leaders of the framework we'll discuss. A number of proposals to solve the political crisis including the formation of a committee whose mission is to discuss with the leader of the Sadis movement Mastada al Sadr to reverse the decision to withdraw and lastly Caperoni says within a month or so the IMF will release the latest article for consultation with Iraq which was completed last month and will give us an update on monetary policy you